नमस्कार फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू चैनल सिंपलीफाई योर स्पेस किचन इन आर होम्स आर ऑलवेज एट फोर फ्रंट टू कीप अस वेल फेड एंड हेल्थी इट इज अ ब्लेसिंग टू हैव किचन दैट कैन फुलफिल वॉट आर टमी एंड टेस्ट बट स्ट्रीम ऑफ इट इज इम्पॉर्टेंट दैट वी कैन रेसिप्रोकेट बाय कीपिंग इट क्लीन एंड इन ऑर्डर whether you do it yourself or take help a crisp routine can go a long way in maintaining your kitchen well in today's video i will share few tips and hacks to clean the kitchen mess and items fast to save time let's get started dry curry and batter stains on the hob are hard to clean use this kind of baking scraper to nicely scrape off the dry residues and remove it will come off in seconds Now just spray the all purpose cleaner and wipe the hob. So easy and fast. Sometimes the floor falls on the counter while making chapati or kneading the dough. Cleaning the floor with the cloth will make the cloth dirty. Never use wet cloth to clean it as after mixing with wet cloth it will become sticky. then it will stick to the counter and the cloth making cleaning even more difficult so if you see any dry floor on the counter just take a squeegee or scraper to clean it once the dry floor removed clean the counter as usual if you have a white pots counter top like mine you need to be always extra careful with the turmeric stains which are hard to clean if not taken care on time sometimes we ignore and the counter top starts getting yellow with stains to remove these stains rub white toothpaste on the affected area and leave it for 15 minutes now wash it nicely and clean with dish liquid soap stains are gone completely Regular cleaning of kitchen cabinets from outside is important as they are prone to get stains from frequent touches and splashes of oil while cooking. Traditionally, we all clean the cabinets by wiping down each and every cabinet manually, which is a time-consuming task. To make it easy, use a squeegee with the cloth and wipe down the cabinets, which is much faster. or you can get this kind of squeegee bottle with the cleaning pad on it just spray and wipe using the cleaning pad the job will be done much faster now if you have a big fridge like this it is difficult to move around to clean its sides lot of dust get accumulated on the sides and it is very hard to reach there To clean it use this kind of flat microfiber duster with extendable rod which can easily reach the corners All the dust will get stick to it and come off easily Same problem hame inbuilt hob ke sath bhi hoti hai Lot of food residues and liquid get accumulated on the edges of the hob making it smell bad To clean the edges use this baking scraper or butter knife and wrap a disinfectant towel on it. Now start from one end and slowly move it forward and come to the other end. All the dirt and grime will come off nicely. Grease and grime collected over a time on the chimney filters make them less effective in controlling smoke. and this grease is difficult and time consuming to clean best way i have found out is to put it in the dishwasher with the regular daily load and your filters will come out sparkling clean after washing the dishes cleaning the sink properly is very important to avoid nasty smell and pest but this kind of taps make the process bit slow Having a sink tap shower can make your sink cleaning much faster as it can move 360 degrees and all the corners and edges can be cleaned easily. 
you may also go with this type of sink tap shower without pipe washing veggies and dishes can be very easy with this without wasting much water fridge doors get stained with frequent touches stains are more visible in this type of fridge with stainless steel finish and we need to clean it more often to keep it shiny and you don't get any protective covers for these kind of fridge handles so what i do is cover them with the small kitchen cloths they protect the handles with dirty fingerprints and keep the fridge stain free also whenever i notice any stain while accessing the fridge i instantly pick up the cloth from here and clean it with just take a few seconds If you have this kind of hob cleaning the burners from inside is very difficult. Lot of food residues get accumulated inside which affects the burning efficiency. And as they have narrow opening cleaning them from inside is a big challenge. To clean it first with the help of a small screw driver scrape the residues. Make sure it is dry. Now take a vacuum cleaner with a crevice tool and a straw. Put the straw inside the burner where you have all the dust and residues and cover the top with vacuum cleaner and start the suction. Keep moving the straw for effective cleaning. All the dust and debris will get collected efficiently by the vacuum cleaner and your burners will get cleaned. Whenever we heat up any gravy item in the microwave, it splashes out and make the microwave dirty from inside. If that happens with you as well always clean the microwave after each use but that's time consuming or take a microwave dish cover which helps keeping your microwave clean from inside whatever you keep just cover it with this and even if the gravy splashes out only the cover will get soiled which is much easier to clean Glass bottles with narrow openings is difficult to clean as regular bottle cleaning brush can't reach inside. Like I have this bottle which has dust at the bottom which I'm not able to clean with the bottle brush. To clean you need these kind of white garden stones. If you don't have these you can use regular dry rice. Now put some of these stones in the bottle and add dish liquid and water in it. Now shake the bottle and rotate the mixture all around. Leave it for 5 minutes. Now strain the mixture and clean the bottle with fresh water. All the dust is gone completely and bottle is nicely clean from inside. So these were some of the tips and hacks which can help you save time in your kitchen cleaning. Some time back I also made a video on how do I maintain my white kitchen. Please have a look if you're looking to maintain your white kitchen or otherwise. The link is given in the description box. Thank you for watching this video. Please give a thumbs up and share this video with your family and friends. Do subscribe to our channel and follow us on Instagram and Facebook for all the latest updates and video notifications. We'll see you all next Saturday. Happy organizing from Simplify Your Space. Bye bye.